In this video, we're going to talk about types of angles, so how to identify them based on their measurement. So we have acute, obtuse, and right angles. I apologize for the little typo here. I crossed them off, but it should be correct on your page. So an acute angle is less than 90 degrees. So I gave you a little spot to also draw in so that you can actually draw it. So I start with a 90 degree angle so that I can base it off of that because that's kind of how a lot of these names work. So here's a 90 degree angle, a nice corner. Okay, so corner of your paper is a really easy way to get that 90 degree angle. And then an uh, acute angle is just going to be a line. You just draw it anywhere in between. It doesn't have to be kind of midway like this. Anywhere in between here, you draw an angle and that's or a, a array, sorry, and that's going to create an angle less than 90 degrees because it's chopping the 90 into pieces. Okay, so again, it does not have to match this one. I could draw it much closer to the top here. I could draw it much closer to the bottom here. As long as I'm within the 90 when I draw the ray, then I've done what I need to do. Um, so the it could be either this area or this area. Either one is considered an acute angle. So think smaller than 90. Um, and I know I've I've heard teachers and, you know, other people go, oh, it's so cute. You know, it's little. <laughs> so, um, all right. A an obtuse angle is more than 90. So, and obtuse kind of that has like a big sound to it for whatever reason. I don't know. It always seems like it sounds big to me. Um, so I start with the 90 degree angle again here, but I want something bigger. So I'm going to draw a ray outside of the 90. I'm going to add to it. I'm going to make it even bigger. So 90 plus a little bit more. Okay, so it's larger than 90 degrees. And then the last one here, I have a right angle is 90 degrees. So that's the one that we've drawn. Probably should have done that first because there's our basic 90 degree that we've been drawing this whole time. Right. So now what we're going to do is we're going to classify the four angles of this quadrilateral. Quadrilateral just means a four-sided figure. Um, so angle A, if I go down here to angle A, well, 110, that's more than 90. So that's going to be obtuse. And then angle B... That's 60 degrees, that's less than 90, so that's gonna be acute. Angle C, well that's more than 90 at 100, so that's obtuse again. And then angle D, well that is 90, so that's our right angle. So that's all I want you to do is understand what obtuse, acute, and right mean, and how to identify them within a figure. So I hope that helped, and I'll see you in the next video.